the gear worn by Supercross riders not only looks good, but it has tons of function. From the high-tech materials to the biomechanical design, today's moto gear is built to perform. How we build the pant is really geared towards the rider attack position, and that's why each panel is put in a particular place. The whole pant has four-way stretch fabric on it that stretches both vertically and horizontally. The rider's making such dynamic moves on a bike, that fabric needs to work with him. On the seat of a motocross pant, we've used a more durable non-stretch fabric that allows the rider to maintain good contact with his bike. On the knees, it feels kind of like leather, so that makes it grippier on the plastics. So, you know, when you're going through whoops and, and moving, you don't have a lot of, you know, sliding around. We compress the bike and squeeze it so hard, so that's also, they make that for durability. We're really sitting into the jumps to get over some of them, so. Where it goes around your waist, the waistband just has little rubber-ish stuff to where it can kind of grip on to your underwear, just to your skin so they don't slide down. Throughout the pant, we've also integrated different ventilation zones. That allows the air to flow through the pant. Some of the goals behind the jerseys, we really want this to be almost like there's nothing at all in the body. We use fabrics that help the rider control their body heat and their body temperature. We put certain seam lines in certain places to allow the body to really move. We're actually utilizing a bonded neckline and a bonded cuff. The sleeves is actually an Italian Carvico material. We've selected it based on its abrasion resistance and its ability to recover after it stretches. Your forearms, when you ride, your muscles will expand a little bit. You want it to be able to breathe and, and just because if, if it's tight, then you're gonna get arm pump. You won't be able to hold onto the bike. I'm really picky when it comes to gloves. Um, I like it to be really thin, basically just so I can have the most feel on my handlebars and my grips. The material that goes in between each finger is a mesh material, so it allows for the airflow through the glove and the hand. We also have a perforated palm material that provides breathability and grip. 